right, so we are here with Tom Tice. He is the owner of Island Water Sports here in Stone Harbor. Uh, Tom, tell us how long you've been around the water sports place because this is a family business for you. Yeah, so honestly, I've been around the water sports my entire life. My parents started this back in 1988, and I grew up. I've done every single job here. And then I was lucky enough to be given the opportunity to take it over and kind of take control of the whole thing five years ago. So this is my fifth year now. So when people walk in here, what can they expect? They can really expect anything fun on the water. We offer wave runner rentals, kayaks, paddle boards. You can go on ski boats where you're tubing, wakeboarding, water skiing. We offer sunset cruises, party cruises. We also have the famous aqua park, which is a huge, huge crowd pleaser for all ages is to jump and splash around in the water. Gotcha. And are, would you say wave runners are your favorite part of here, or is there maybe something else you like better? Yeah, I do love the wave runners because I love going fast and the thrill that comes with it. Yeah. I'm a big wave runner guy myself, but uh, that's for another day. Um, tell us about um, just what the vibe is like here with you and your staff throughout the year. I mean, we're recording this in mid-July, so we're in peak summer, but what's it like in May? What's it like in you know now? What's it like in September? Yeah, so we open on Memorial Day, and it definitely is a slow start. It's tough with staffing issues specifically because everyone's still in school. I still get the college kids, but a lot of my staff is still in high school. So once they start getting out in mid-June, the business really starts to pick up. I can actually have like a set schedule and I know who's coming in every day. And then we go pretty hard until Labor Day. Labor Day is our last day just because I start losing everyone mid-August for school again. So it gets kind of tough. The beginning and the end of the season, I really hurt on staff and especially at the end, we're still really busy and I'm losing staff left and right, but we make it work. What's your favorite part of just seeing the people who come here and are paying customers for you? I love, what I say is we sell smiles. I love seeing how much fun people have and just, I like going the extra mile for everyone and just ensuring everybody has a great time and they're enjoying their vacation. What brings you here from Utah all the way over to Jersey Shore? We thought we'd go camping. You went camping, okay. So are you camping now? Sort of. It's. A rental house, camper kind of thing, yeah. Okay. And, like, why jet skiing when you're here at the shore? We are hitting everything on the shore. We're going surfing, jet skiing, fishing. We're doing a little bit of everything every day. Have you been jet skiing in Salt Lake City? There is a lake there, right? You can jet ski? You can't jet ski, but there we've been to the lake. Okay. How does, how does the lake compare to the Jersey Shore here? It's completely different. There's so much salt there, and it's more of, like, a viewing, a tourist site. You don't go in the water. You don't go in the water. Uh, how cool was it to be on the jet ski today? It was scary. Tell us, tell us more. <laughs> <laughs> it was too fast. And she was scared, and I was scared, and then it was just really hard to, to find a good speed to go okay. for the both of us. All right, gotcha. I'm going to turn to you since you're from Pennsylvania. I'm guessing you've been here before, right? Uh, I've been to Avalon fishing. Okay, gotcha. Is this your first time jet skiing too? Uh, we were at the, we went to Stone Harbor for for the beach last summer. Okay. During the pandemic. Okay. Why did you decide to come here for jet skiing? Was there something about the town? Was it something you just trying to find a jet ski place? What what brought you here? Uh, friends of ours from the main line who um, visit Cape May a lot recommended Island Water Sports because of the water park that's on the bay. Did you guys go to water park too? Uh, not yet. Okay. So you guys. I'm going to turn back over to you guys. So you guys are going to Water Park next? Hopefully. Okay. Did, did you see the Water Park before? Yeah. yeah, it looks like a lot of fun.